Hang tight, my friends. I'll be back in just a minute or two, and we'll get this show on the proverbial road. Be right back. See, that's one of the big reasons I got the real mixer, because when you tab out of Windows games, they mute. That's really annoying. Hello, everybody. How are we doing tonight? Oh. I have two young kids. That's how I'm doing. And it's election night, but we won't go into that shit. Instead... We'll go sling nuclear bombs around DC to take out our frustration. Sound good? Sounds good to me too. It's in the game. It's not a threat. <laughs> um, so we actually had a really good time last time. We got a powered armor fan finally, which you really can't see very well. But we have we know how to use powered armor now. So yay for that. That's good. And when I came back here to fix stuff, um we got a distress signal from Vault 101 that we should go check out at probably. Let me see some. What are we doing here? How are we doing on... We just have so much junk. We've got like 100 pounds of weight though to carry. Uh-oh. You knew a partner you're not taking either? I'll, I'll go look at Discord in a little bit. You're having a heck of a time with that moving thing, Grace. I hope it ends up working out for you. You'd best have cancer, because from the looks of you, you're breaking rule number one right now. Well, that's not adult. Let's let's game instead, which is the which is not adult. So it goes any more than absolutely necessary. Mm, excuse me. Not quite as good as that vault stuff you're used to, but it'll do you. Let's see here. We have. A lot of ammo, but ammo's weightless, so we'll keep the ammo for now. Oh, that's a lot of five, five, six. Where'd I get all that at? I don't think I have anything that shoots five millimeter. Maybe we'll trade some of that in for some stem packs. Let me see something real quick. Shotgun shells, thirty-two caliber, forty-four missiles, zero eight ten. Yeah, I don't use 5mm for anything, so we're going to sell that. It's weightless, but we have 400 caps worth of 5mm we're sitting right here, which is a lot of stem packs. We can do 10 stem packs. He's going to say, give me 370 caps, and I'm going to say, how about 800 bullets? And he'll say, oh, okay, I'm a doctor, but that sounds reasonable. It's fine. Take this one too, actually. <laughs> yes, I will give you four caps for 11 stem packs. I'm fine with that if you are.
Grenades actually weigh stuff and I don't want them because I don't use them because they blow up in my face and that's annoying. Sell the scotch too. And a toy car. Okay. You done? Good. I am good. Sure can. And a quick. Try to be. Okay, we're good. Let us go see if. We can see what's up in Vault 101. As soon as I'm in the is out. And give relief to this rotten flesh. Oh, that's the wrong way. Unworthy servant. We stay true until the day of division. I have a new mouse too. It's actually, I'm, I'm, I'm actually kind of like digging it for this game. Let's see Good if I complain you. about the buttons and that clicking like I did with my own mouse quite as Hello? much. I don't think I will somehow. No, I just want to say there's a waypoint. Yes. Actually, hang on. Do you have a quest? This is an automated distress message from Vault Tech. Vault 101. Message begins. It feels like you left home a long time ago, but I know you're still out there. I just hope you're still alive to hear this. Things got worse after you left. My father's gone mad with power. If you can hear this, please stop looking for your dad and help stop mine. I changed the door password to my name. If you're hearing this, and if you still care enough to help me, you should remember it. Message repeats. This is What's an her name? automated <laughs> distress message. Uh, We have some more weaponry than we had last time, too. I think I'm gonna go in there and shoot the shit out of this place. What do you guys think? Sound good? They were a bunch of jerks when we left last time, so I think they deserve it. Should I have waited till morning, possibly? Yeah, we'll be fine. I kind of wanted to walk there. I really should have just fast traveled, though. I recall it being kind of a pain to get to, but we'll see. Oh. Oh. There we go. You know what? Kind of feel like shooting them, but I won't because I'm a nice person. save here. Let's go see what's going on. Yeah, her. Thank you. I think I'm going to be shooting some people. What do you think?
everybody in here is red right now. Oh, it's rad roaches. Missed. Didn't miss. I think that worked that ammo. My stealth boy. We'll take that. Oh, poor Steve Armstrong. I hardly knew you. I honestly don't remember you at all. Stop right there. I don't know how you got in here, but... Hold hey, on. Hey, go, Matt. How you doing, man? Wait a minute. It's you. And the power I armor. I recognized you with all the dust and grime from out there. Guess that explains how you got that door open. You've got more experience with it than most everyone down here combined. You just thought you'd pop in? Don't take this the wrong way, but you probably ought to just turn around and not come back. Things, well, they haven't gone very well since you and your dad left. This isn't the happy vault you grew up in anymore. There's real trouble. Let me bring you up to speed. It seems like it's been a mighty long time. The night you and your dad left, everything went crazy. Between the bugs and the confusion, we lost a lot of people. When your dad opened up that gate, he let loose a whole lot of crap. Call it shit. Pardon it's fine. Language. I'm... I'm sorry to hear that. Regardless of how things turned out down here, he was a good friend. I always figured he'd do well outside. Matter of fact, a lot of folks started thinking he had the right idea. He usually did. So, if it was safe out there, why well, stay down here forever? Well, the overseer didn't like that one bit mm. and started cracking down on that sort of thought. Guess he didn't plan Let's on scooping some heads back. together. I can't do that. Not officially, at least. As much as some of the rebels would like to talk with you, the overseer said you weren't welcome back. I will shoot you in the face. Of course, if you survived whatever's <laughs> out there, none of us could stop you if you really wanted to cause problems. But I'd prefer if you don't. But out of respect to your dad, I could turn a blind eye. You could slip out and say you were never here. I won't tell a soul. Well, okay. Just be careful down here. The vault's changed, I tell you. I mean, other than all the, you know, murdering and, and torturing that was happening when I was here last time? Yeah, it's so much different now. Excuse me. <laughs> Do you think he'd notice if I try picking his pocket? Honestly, that was a waste of a bullet. I should have used a smaller gun. Oh well. Hey, Duck, the adjustable sensitivity on this mouse is actually really nice. It lets me change how far I have to move the mouse to do stuff depending on if I'm moving a mouse cursor or if I'm navigating a character on screen. I like it. It's actually a nice feature. the other way first. <laughs> Is this locked? Is 
somewhere through here. There was a secret door. Oh, hi, you. That might be a little excessive. I keep saying that. I keep doing it anyway. Pre-war spring outfit. Agility plus one. Yeah, sure, why not? Maybe spring again one day. At the helm of the overseer's room. You know I can't do that, Freddy. Now get back down below before I have to do something we'll both regret. What? You're gonna lock me up like you did to Brotch? You can't cage a tunnel snake, man, because we rule! Stay back! I could kill him. Don't you know enough to stay away? I didn't mean to fire. I really didn't. I just wanted to scare him off. But he had enough. Oh, the tunnel snakes are the I rebels? Be too careful with those rebels. Mm, I don't know how I feel about that. I tell you, I'm scared of them. I never know when they're going to try something dangerous. I lost my poor wife, Agnes, is what happened. And all the chaos and fighting. That sucks. Ticker just couldn't take it anymore. Yes, you do. Don't you know enough to stay away? Yes, you do. As it turns away, turns out, no, I really don't know enough to do anything. Give me a second here. Mm, Oh, the common room's closed off? Man. You don't belong here anymore. Okay. Did this go in a giant loop? Yes, yes, I did. <laughs> Do we have two quest markers down here? Yeah, a second. Uh, this place has seen better days. Damn. Look who's come waltzing back into the vault. 
It takes some real balls coming back here after everything you and your dad screwed up. But if you've got to be back, might as well make yourself useful. You gotta help us. What sort of help do you think I mean? You must have heard about the changes since you left, right? The deaths, the lies, the whole overseer lockdown thing. Oh, that Ringing thing. any bells? Man, they'd have rushed in here long ago if they didn't know I stole one of their guns from when they issued martial law. Anyway, you gotta help us get out of here. You gotta help me get out of here. Man, screw the entire vault. What about me? Dude, you Even got to your fuck. these fucked. rebels just want the option to go outside for lousy trading and stuff. I just want to get the hell out of here for good. Why stay here and be stuck as a barber for my entire <laughs> life when I could go out there and make my own choices? The damn goat said I'm supposed to be a hairdresser, but that ain't me. Oops. I'm a barber. You got that? There's a difference. I'll start a gang, of course. Why, it'll be the toughest, coolest, he'll die is what gang he'll do. the Wasteland's ever seen. Hey, play your cards right. Maybe I'll even let you join it, huh? Well, they ain't seen nothing like me yet. Butcher's gonna take that wasteland by storm. I heard old Stanley complaining a lot of the stuff down in the reactor got fried pretty bad. Uh, nothing too bad, yet. But he's always worrying we'll lose air filtration or whatever. Of course, if that happened, <coughs> guess we'd all have to leave the vault then, huh? Because you've always been a goody two-shoes. So when I need help, it's what you're gonna do, right? You're gonna help Amada anyway, right? Just make it so we can leave the vault. And I'll leave and never bother you again. Can you give me a haircut, Butch? Catch you later. Maybe. Let's find Amada and talk to her. I suspect, but don't know. That she is one area pack. I have a cough. Hang on a second. Let's see if that got it up. Okay, let's go see what we got over here. Attention to what you're doing. Shut up. Okay, this is just a hub, isn't it? I'm trying to figure out where this is at. I see you've returned. Yeah. Done with the dust and ruins of the wasteland, are you? Given up looking for daddy? Thought you oh, were I just should slink shoot him. back in like a teen missing curfew? Well, that's too bad. You have no future in this vault. You're tainted. Really? And here I had expected you to be full of bullets and bravado, but short on brains. Perhaps you've grown up since you left our vault. I regret the unfortunate events of that night, but I'm afraid that once your father left us, I'm they were kill him, I think. unavoidable. The sad truth is that his actions presented a real and direct threat to the future success of our vault. And so, regrettably, they had to be opposed. Aha, you're paying attention. Good for you. These vaults were designed to be safe havens for humanity, you see. 
But more than that, they were designed to test and protect us. And none more so than our Vault 101. We are to be a pure and protected breed of humans, never tainted by the ravages of the war above. And what makes you so certain about that? I can't imagine you're still so naive after spending time in that hell outside. None of them know what the outside is like, and most of them would die out there. Then the rest of us inside would eventually die out too. That's true. I won't risk all of our lives just for a few people's passing fancy of taking a wasteland vacation. If they're just going to die anyway understand that. in a small war. To fix what you started? Go ahead and humor me. <laughs> yes. I need to find Amida and talk to her. Amada. I want to make sure that she's okay if I murder her dad. Not that I'm thinking about murdering her. Yes, I am. You don't belong here anymore. Oh, water with no radiation. Oh, what a luxury. Jayhawk, thank you for the follow, sir. Ma'am. Entity. There we go. We'll go with that. You don't belong here anymore. I don't know that I should be talking with you. Probably shouldn't be. It's just a phase they're going through. Every kid thinks they want to leave the vault at some point, but we all grew out of it. With all of the bugs and fires, there was an awful lot of strain on the systems down on the reactor level. Our water chip's pretty delicate right now, but I'm working on setting her right again. I know a vault in California, they have like a dozen of those things. I sure wish we could blow this joint. Yeah, you know. Oh my god, you're back! You got <gasps> my message and actually came yes, back! Yes, I did! <laughs> yeah, but I got something to do. Oh, thank you! Everything's gone crazy since you left, and now that you're back, you can help set things straight. I can make that happen. Fallout 4 dog um, dog meat percent. I can do that. I think you may actually start Fallout 4 with him. He was pretty heavy in the marketing, but I'm not sure. I just wish we could have saved more people. Jonas and, and the Hannons and so many others died that night. It was bad enough they died because my father was trying to keep the door closed. But then I found out it was all to protect a lie. I found out the vault wasn't always closed. 
They've lied to us about it for our entire lives. Uh-huh. After that night, I heard Wally's father say we should never have taken you or your dad into the vault. I found out the vault used to be open, but for some reason, they closed it off when we were babies and swore to hide that it had ever happened. But keeping that lie meant Jonas's death. And even though we know the truth, the Overseer still won't let us make our own decisions. Are you honestly comparing, maybe we should look for help, with stay in an <laughs> underground bunker all your life or I'll kill you? Mm. Obviously, I don't know what's out there, but it can't hurt to take a look, right? Yeah, it can, actually. And all this time, we're living in a tiny world that's been falling apart for 200 years. If we don't take a chance out there, we're just going to die down here. But none of that can happen while my father's got the place locked down. Please, something has to be done. You know that better than anyone. I certainly hope so. We can't keep going on like this. You will? Thank goodness for that. No matter what I say, he just doesn't listen. Should I kill him or should I sabotage the reactor? Office. But you've actually been outside, so you can tell him what it's like with first-hand experience. Just please don't do anything rash or hurt him, all right? Hmm. Well, yes, but he may have done some terrible things, but he's still my father, you know? Please, for my sake, don't hurt him. No promises, but okay. I guess. Hey. Oh, hey, look, there's water here. You've got to change the Overseer's You're alive! <clears throat> I hate that this whole thing has turned us against our families. But we just can't keep living down here forever. I mean, look at this place. You don't have enough janitors. A lot of security got wounded, and worse. In all the confusion, we still don't know who's responsible for some of them. Bye. Bye. Oh, it's good to see you're back from outside. It can be dangerous out there for someone your age. Oh dear, we aren't asking for anything special. The vault's been open before, but for some reason everyone tries to pretend it wasn't. I guess they try to forget the poor souls who never came back from out there. My poor grandson Jonas died is what happened. They say it was just an accident and all the confusion, but I know it was the overseer. Oh. She didn't say yes, you do. I have to love. I never thought you'd be back. Gosh, I want to shoot Butch so bad. Is that wrong of me? I don't feel like that's wrong of me at all. This looks terrible.
Mm, make why not in a stick. Mm. Okay, I guess I'll hack the terminal. Shouldn't leave frag grenades just sitting around next to the reactor. That's dangerous. People don't think. You never should have left, kid. Now we'll make sure nobody ever leaves again. Oh, you got behind the door. That's fine. The overseer won't talk that kind of behavior. Anything good? Jail cell password. Familiar. I'm hanging with this just for giggles. Oh, that sucks. Actually, we'll take these. We'll use it for repairing stuff later. Then gone and stripped them down to a skivvies. We'll close the door. We'll pretend like that never happened. Where do you think the jail is at? Not that those people sleep. Should really be disintegrating people, I think. That's not a weapon. This is a weapon. Okay. <laughs> He's sleeping up a baseball bat on his back. I'm just running in circles right now. Let's bend the overseer. Where's he at? Oh, there he is. Up in his office. How do I get up there? I don't remember.
don't remember how to get up there. Shit. Upper level. Oh, there it is. On the plus side, if I do kill him, what do you want? It'd be if a laser rifle, and I'll probably disintegrate him. They have to understand that we did that to keep them from going outside and getting killed, to keep them from making the same mistake our generation did when we were their age. Yeah. Some of us already lost loved ones out there long ago. We won't lose any more today. To fix. Oh, do you? What makes you think you know how better to protect this vault? I admit, in the 200 years since the war, our numbers have dwindled a little. But we have enough genetic diversity for a few more generations. Mm -hmm. My god, you're right. We won't last another hundred years, whether or not we get supplies from the outside. We're the last bastion of pure humanity, and we're doomed. I wouldn't worry about it. <laughs> I wish I could share your optimism, but I suppose you have a point in your blathering way. My way won't save our vault's mission, but if I let them contact the outside world, I might be able to save its inhabitants. But I'm not the one to lead them in that. I'm stepping down as overseer. I'll tell Amata. Oh, good. If I kill I you, I won't be killing the overseer now. Leader than she. I'm assuming he knows where Amata is. That's why I'm following him. Ah, uh, he's gonna get away from me. Oh, okay. We're just going back to the same place he was before. Listen closely. After a discussion with your friend, I've made an important decision. In my attempts to keep us all safe, I have been, perhaps, overzealous. Lives have What's been the lost, big idea? But perhaps, worse than that, lives have been stopped. And in my attempts... Ah, another patient! What's it to be, eh? Appendectomy? Tonsillectomy? Hysterectomy? Ah, yes, a rather unfortunate incident. In all the commotion, Miss Beatrice suffered a rather bad sprain in her left toe. The big one. Obviously, I had no choice but to amputate the leg. Yeah, I'm sorry to say the operation was uh, not a um, success. But of course, with your father's departure from the vault and Jonas's untimely demise, the overseer had to take swift action. <laughs> and so he named me the new vault medical practitioner. A marvelous decision, if I do say so myself. I am fully equipped, after all. Uh huh. I think I found her foot. That is why I cannot remain your overseer. Father! Amata, I appoint you overseer in my place. You've proven you have what it takes to make hard choices for the good of the vaults. I'm just sorry I didn't understand that earlier. Consider it one of many mistakes I've made. Thank you, Father. I'll... What'd you do that for? Oh, it's a fight! I think... 
she's dead. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm okay. Thank you, Father. I'll do my best to keep us all safe. I had a daydream. It was a daydream. It was just a daydream. You're That's welcome, all it was. my dear. And now, if you'll excuse me, I feel quite worn down. We'll deal with the details soon, in private. <laughs> Until then, I'm sure there are people waiting to congratulate you. Hello. I, I just heard. My father says he's stepping down as overseer. He won't tell me why, but I have to assume it's something you said to him. You and him? Civil? I expected you to change out in the wasteland. Don't make me shoot you. Much. But I guess we'll all be learning a bit about the outside now, won't we? As a new overseer, I'm planning on opening the vault. This time for good. Good luck. It's a bright new day for the vault. But I'm afraid there's one thing that has to change. There are still so many things to repair and a lot of bad I have to leave. To Some people still blame you for what happened. Hey, so, necrophobic. How you done? I have to ask you to leave. I'm sorry, but the situation is just I'm just going to start killing everybody I see. I mean, seriously. Please, if you really want to help the vault, you have to go. No, it's not like that. But if you stay, it'll just keep causing more problems. The vault can't take any more infighting. It's just what has to be. It'll be a while before we're ready to really go outside. They're all gonna but once die the vault anyway. is stable again, maybe we'll see you after. So, I guess this is goodbye for now. It's not much, but take this with you to remember us by. With luck, we'll meet again. I never thought you'd be back. And I'm leaving. So fuck all of you. <laughs> Leave me alone. I pissed them off, I think. <laughs> Fuck all of them. I was hoping to disintegrate them in one shot. It didn't work out. Just for the, you know, the added satisfaction of having killed him forever. But, you know, whatever, it's fine. Good riddance, get out. Fuck you kindly, too. It's um, it's not as hard as you might think, but it's also not as easy as you might hope either. <laughs> Aren't you going to close the door behind me? Seriously. Here, I'll close it for you. No, I guess I won't. Oh, there it goes. Ah, DC. Looks just like I remember it. A blasted waste, no man's wasteland full of scum and villainy. <sighs> Never change.
Hmm. What if I could do this yet? Maybe. I don't know. No? Okay. Search Pharaoh Gulk foot. I'm gonna have way too much fucking loot on me, aren't I? It's okay. Serious worth a lot of caps. Since everybody's dying anyway, I don't have to worry about feeling bad about it. Disintegrating things is fun. Everybody enjoys disintegrating things. I am... Wait. I am going the wrong way. Um, same as always, uh, it's a um, soulless hellhole. Want to see something cool? Look, power armor. Get it, get it last session. At the very end. I'm wearing a Enclave helmet because my normal power armor helmet was in not great shape. Hang on, does it want me to go in there? No. Not once we go over here. Okay. Power armor is very sneaky too if you use it right. Just crouch down and try to think small thoughts. I'm gonna go rescue Riley's Rangers now. It's been a while. I've been ignoring them for a bit. I figure they probably need my help now. Wait, does somebody go downside the station? It does, doesn't it? Interesting. Okay. Is this the new station? Have I not been in here before? I have been in here before. But apparently... It's not where I was. Why I didn't say to go to DuPont Circle, I, I just can't begin to guess. I took the plus 50 weight carrying capacity perk because I got so sick and tired of running out of carrying capacity.
I need to go. This way. Up, 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 up. I'll be honest, in pure stat numbers, like damage reduction and stuff, the power armor in this game isn't a lot better than what I was wearing, but all the other perks are nice, so it's still worth wearing instead. And it doesn't appear to actually require batteries, which is good, because that would be super annoying. Okay, somebody's already searched. Somebody's already looted all these hash piles. Oh, wait, I didn't want to come up here, did I? Nope, I want to be done on the track still. I think you also missed all the button Gwinnett scenes, which I'll be honest, were all kind of awesome. I'm gonna guess I can't just lift this up in my power armor and go out it. Nope. Okay, fine. We'll go this way. Oh, that wasn't very involved. Okay. I expect super mutants to start shooting at me any moment. Told you. All dead. I don't know if you saw, but back behind, like from this arc down, his head went flying off the off the bridge behind him. It was actually kind of cool. The plus side, that means if I can find his head, I can loot him without figuring out how to get on top of that bridge, which is hilarious and awesome at the same time. I am really low on honey rifle ammo. So if you were an angry super mutant head, where would you have landed? Probably on top of this truck, right? Never mind, there he is.
I guess it was his hand? I don't know. Whatever. I guess I blew his gut straight out of his head. <laughs> I'm okay. I get the feeling this may not have been exactly where I wanted to go. But then again, maybe it is. I really don't like centaurs. They they freak me out for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it's the tentacles and shit. Are you using that arm? I hope not. Oh, ouch. I should really um, take a stem pack or two because he is lighting me up. Jesus, ouch. Can you hold that thought for a second while I eat some food? Mutt fruit? Yeah, sure. Apples? Mm -hmm. Water? No, we'll do that later. Dog meat? No, that, that feels wrong. Human flesh, I still tend to avoid. Mire lurk, on the other hand, sounds tasty. I've made several friends. Just shoot him in the arms repeatedly. <laughs> you know, I would have been more than happy to give them hugs. They didn't come charging at me with their guns first. Just saying, that kind of ruined it.
Does shooting somebody with a laser count as hugging them? I'm just wondering. It could be a warm hug, right? The Edatronic 3000. I'm sure this is not all well expired by now. We'll be fine. Found a uh, found a mine. It it hurt. Ouch. I, hang on. This is did I lose both my legs? I didn't. However, there is a black uh, black cat crossing my path. Oh no, I lost one leg and one arm. Okay, never mind. Let's let's fix that. Look at that bottle of those stim packs. I like the way his head flew off before the rest of his body disintegrated. It made me feel really good about myself. I feel like maybe this isn't fair to the super mutants, but honestly, they've given me so much trouble for the rest of the game. I don't feel so bad about it. Crippled my head, backing up from the mine. <laughs> Just imagine the surprise look at my face. I, I have this cartoon picture in my face of, of like scorch marks, and my hair shot straight back. <laughs> Thankfully, I'm wearing a powered armor helmet, so it's not quite as bad as it could have been. I still have a head attached to my shoulders. But now I guess I know why they never came downstairs. They were trying to lure me up here. So I'd walk into the pines. <sighs> so rude. can't repair my power armor in the field, which is annoying. I feel like this could be an issue. This? Oh, wait, this is safe right there. Aha! There you are. I knew there'd be one of you up here somewhere. Did you know centaurs explode it when you crit at them? Neither did I.
Let's see here. What do we got? That sounds interesting. That sounds interesting too, but unfortunately, I don't want to lose all of my um, good karma. <laughs> oh, I think I like this. Hang on. I think I really like this. I wonder if this means I can sneak while walking. You don't get the little the little info thing, I bet though. But still, I like this one a lot. So many good perks. We're gonna take silent running. Why does it keep exploding when I sneak attack them? Is that me or is that a perk? I... Thanks for the host, Hobbs. How you doing, man? I have two really good hunting rifles now. I do have the bloody mess perk. That's so good. I don't remember the laser critting with an explosion before, so I don't know what's going on with that. That's twice in a row it's happened, though. So I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. I don't know what's going on yet. I haven't decided. So I have to show this off. I got a Corsair mouse by the way. Check it out right here. These two rocker buttons right here raise and lower the DPI on it so the cursor moves faster and slower. Uh, that button makes you shoot, by the way. <laughs> and this red button on the side lowers it to 300 DPI. It's called the sniper button. When you hold it down, you move really slowly, which is great for dialing in your sniper shots. Gotta have good hardware to play these games. The roaches went to ash. Um, maybe it's something in here. I don't know. You know, if there's a gas leak, it'll explode. So maybe there was a gas leak near them. But that seems weird to be in two different spots like that. I 
I wish the this is definitely a right-handed mouse. It would I it sucks being a left-handed gamer, it really does. And you know what? That could have done it, Hobbs. I have had a little bit of gas. So it's possible. I didn't need my allowance replenished. Thank you. Um. It's been about a year and three months since it happened last time. She's just getting to that age where falling down hurts a lot. And our hardwood floor is actually, the one in the kitchen, is actually really slippery now. We're not sure why. It might just be from the traffic across it. I need to see if there's some type of cleaning thing I can use to kind of get a little bit of grip on it without making it too bad. Because Maxwell fell like four times yesterday, the short one. Um, he's low to the ground. So him falling down isn't so bad. It doesn't hurt him, but it's it's really slippery. If we can't find something to clean it with, we're going to toss a carpet down. Yeah, that's that. that I, I would rather not because the wood looks really nice. But if we had to put rugs down, we will. Six out of nine. Um, that means it's R E I N G. That's four. that's five. What's the sixth one? N R E M A I N. So it could be returning if it's the N. Oh, unlock the med supplies that I just picked. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> An extremely painful pull in the groin region of his body. He indicated he was in the company of one Miss Seneca Clarkson at the time, but would not disclose what caused it. Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm okay. I was splashed with caustic chemicals. I like the lockpick game too, so I actually I, I don't mind I don't mind lockpicking stuff. It's a good it's a good mini game for lockpicking. I, I feel like. Hang on. Do I want to go upstairs or stay on this floor? Let's see if this transitions to a new zone. Oh, I never mind. I can't go up those stairs. So I guess I won't go up those stairs. Mainly because I literally cannot go up those stairs. Oh yeah, there was a way through over here that I forgot about. So I want to go back and open the... I feel like one of the Assassin's Creed had a lockpicking game like that, but it used both sticks instead of being keyboard and um, those stairs that were over there that weren't stairs. Those stairs. Oh, it didn't work. Ow! Oh, he. I shot the wall. Oh, wow. He is, looks really angry. I'm gonna eat your arms when you're dead, human! Head hurt. Uh, uh, 
How are you still attacking me so well? Your face is nothing. How long has it been since I saved? Because the game just crashed. I swear to God, Fallout 3, you are going to drive me up the wall. Hang on. I have to, I have to do task manager of keyboard. Oh, it actually, no, it actually went away completely. Good. Uh, Fallout 3 hasn't been patched since... What, Vista, you think? And it gets really upset on any Windows version newer than 7, I think, and crashes all the effing time. So I try to save. I, 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 if you see me quick saving before I do something stupid, it's A, because I'm going to do something stupid, but I also just try to save really often. So that way when it crashes, aha, uh -huh, see there, I don't have to go back that far. See if we can sneak. Let's see if we. You know what though? We get another chance to sneak up on this guy. <laughs> it's fine. How did that not crit him? And where's the other one going? Is he gonna get behind me somehow? Is there another way around here that I don't know about? Oh, no. See, they're not exploding. I can't explain. I really can't explain why some of them explode. I really wish I could repair the power armor in the field. I'm gonna keep complaining about that. Cause I feel like I'm gonna have to go back to town more often wearing this. This is a nice bridge. This seems okay. I don't see what could possibly go wrong here. I probably want to be down a level, I think. I don't actually see anything up here. But the centaur is organic and it exploded. Really? a lot of blood, right? Is that blood or is that carpet? You know, I'm honestly not sure.
Well, that's, that's blood red carpet, you know. It's very good style. What was that? Ah. Ah, of course. <laughs> what was that? Oh yeah, it's gonna blow up, isn't it? <laughs> Ouch. By the way. Ouch. Nuka Cola does a body good, man. I feel good as new now. And I just shot down like 3 million calories worth of sugar. Good time. I kind of wish a little bit that ammo weighed something. So when I was shooting up off all this ammo, I actually got more carrying capacity. I know that's weird though. I keep looking for good books. I found one so far, I think. I'm probably just not being observant enough. I can shoot him in the tongue. I'm not sure why I'd want to do that. I think this hotel says this hotel has seen better days. Sometime back before, you know, everything exploded and fell down. TV doesn't work. <laughs> you 
anyway if you consider your hotel accommodations. But I guess you're almost done, so maybe it's okay. Uh. We were driving back to Texas from the Midwest. And ended up staying in I don't even know where for sure. Oh, I can sleep in this queen with the skeleton. Let's not do that. <laughs> anyway, it, it, it was a it was a hotel. It was like a it was like a not a seventy six something even cheaper. Because we were just there basically to sleep. And the next morning, when we got up at the crack of dawn to continue on our drive. Oh, that's right. Okay. That always freaks me out when that happens. I could not find anybody to check me out. Like, there was no employee anywhere. So we just left the key and left because we had to get going. Okay, it says I should go into the restaurant. Right here. But I can't find the restaurant. Is it upstairs, maybe? I guess it could be upstairs. Assuming upstairs goes somewhere. And upstairs doesn't have a zone transition at the top of it. Which we won't know till we try, I guess. This is where we came in. Yeah. Merc Charmer outfit. Um, yeah, sure. I'll take that. Ooh, eyeballs. Hello. I wonder what that does. I sorry. I wonder how many like fully repaired hunting rifles I'm going to get. Because your key stopped working? That's wonderful. Out. God damn it. 
definitely mean the arm is just rude. Just because he has the word master in his name, he thinks he's special. Hang on a second. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. That's enough of this shit. Okay. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get blown up probably. By the way, just so you guys realize that's gonna happen. I'm gonna peek my head out. He's gonna be right in front of me. And in, if, if this goes to anything like normal, I'm going to momentarily forget that I have a rocket launcher in my hands. And I'm going to shoot him. College! Ugh! Told you that he would do that. God damn it. Okay, hang on. But I remembered. So yay. Lincoln's repeater is a really nice rifle, by the way. Lincoln was a badass. I mean, he had to, he had to have something good to kill all those vampires with. I shot him in the head and shattered his entire body. I love Bloody Mess so much. So the salt rifle, right? Uh, these are both in pretty good shape. So I'm gonna actually. Um, oh, hang on. Can I repair this one? Take it. Okay. I should say. Chunks is chunks, man. Doesn't look exactly like a restaurant to me, but maybe. Mm -mm. Blended and pureed, please. I like to drink my super mutants. That sounds terrible.
Oh, I'm stuck behind the door and I can't move. What do you think, down or up? I'm gonna guess down. I'm gonna guess up. So I said up. I said up. How did you disable my torso in one hit? I'm st I'm 15 hit points from max. Oh man. Oh wait, was that a stim pack? I'm 25 hit points from max, that's what I said. I'm math. I'm gonna prove how big of a geek I am here right now. I'm okay at math. I am horrifically bad at arithmetic. Oh, for fuck's sake. I was like off by like half a degree. I, mean, I don't even want those, they're too heavy. I just want the XP for opening it. So tell us a shithole. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Catch. doing that. The bad part is how many action points it takes to do that. Come on. There we go. Thank you. One of these days when I'm backing up to try to avoid a few hits here and there, I'm going to back across a tripwire and die. Oh, another master. Shit.
I completely missed. So what I get for not using vats. Freaking... those guys so much. Doesn't matter what we're doing. You know, it's seen better days. Saved. I think he was out of range for the first one. I don't know. I mean, I guess I could have just missed, but I don't think I missed. Yeah, there's no way he was out of range. Because I shot the guy on the bridge that was much farther away before he came inside the hotel. Wouldn't it be time for bed as opposed to a nap? Just curious about that. I could be wrong. I don't know. I often don't know what I'm talking about. It just seems reasonable. <laughs> okay, let's go take the elevator and see where it goes. I do too, but I call that bedtime because I stay up way too late and then I only get to sleep for five hours. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Okay, we're not done yet then.
Have a good sleep. Thanks for stopping by. Take it easy. Why did I come over here? Tell me there's something good over here. Game, you're disappointing me greatly. I am disappointed. Another master? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That worked out well. I'm gonna have to take some right away soon. That works okay. I see the plunger storage is well taken care of.
It's a weird way to put a a weird place to put a coat rack. A longer range weapon. Okay, this sucks. I should have just used the laser gun. He crippled my head, didn't he? Here's the elevator. those things. Get those creepy tentacle things going on. They weird me out, man.
game's over! I was using my torso, which you're so, so kindly filling full of holes. Game not over till I say it over. That's how they were exploding before. See how it's wavy? There's more behind him. That's you. My radiation level go up higher? It might have. Yeah. Hmm. 
No. I don't know why am I. Oh, did I? Hang on. Did I never use a stem pack? And status. Condition. No, nothing's injured. I don't know what's up with that. Yeah. Man, my head and my torso have seen better days, though. Like super shootings, like shooting super mutants in a barrel. I hear one still. Upstairs, you think? Probably. That's using your head, dude. I like ashy mole rat meat. That's how you know it's good. Nope, can't repair it with the um sawed off shotgun. So I'm gonna be able to. No dice. That looks painful. Is that a pull cue?
I think they've been having a pretty good time up here personally. You get your ass over here before you attract every super mutant in the building. I killed most of them on the way up. The name's Butcher. I'm the team medic. It's good to see a friendly face. Okay, now who the heck are you, and when are reinforcements coming? Sorry, no can do. I can still put a bullet through a super mutant skull, though. Now, what's up with Riley? She okay? That's a relief. I told her she was nuts when she decided to try to sneak out of here. Guess I was wrong. Now, let's talk about getting out of here. I would have proposed going back the way you came, but apparently it's impossible now. So, the express elevator is our only solution. Mm hmm You're right. What we need is something to power the elevator motor up here and get the thing going. On the way up here, I'm pretty certain we passed a maintenance room. Inside was a wrecked protectron. If you can get me its fission battery, I can have Donovan Jury rig the elevator. Maybe you can, but we'd still need the fission battery. It's the only way to locally feed power into the elevator's electronics. All right, we'll hold the roof position here. If any of us goes down, don't stop. Get the hell out of here and make for our HQ, Ranger Compound. Been there, it looked kind of empty. Why don't you look where you're going? Why don't you bite me? Well, well. We got us a genuine rescue, eh? Yeah, maybe. Like sneaking for the sneak attack bonuses. But sometimes. How far am I going? Yeah, a lot farther than I really wanted to, but that's okay. the heck's that? It's 
map is useless. Could be on this floor, could be down a floor. Must be down the floor. Could be no, the roof is a different map, so it can't be up before. I can get underneath that from here, but let's try. Oh, hang on. I'm blind, aren't I? It's right here. Don't mind me. I am blind as a bat. So it's a sprint button. You could do. service. You break it, I fix it. Thanks. I was starting to feel a little naked without it. Let me have that thing. Give me a few minutes, and I'll have the elevator up and running. As soon as I get it online, we'll get out of here. Rick's the name, and I call this fine-looking room sweeper Eugene. We've had a lot of fun together mowing down super mutants, but I think it's time <laughs> we get off this roof. I like you. Oh, hell yeah! No sweat. Back so soon? Are we in luck? Oh, that makes me feel a whole lot better. Thanks. We're mercs, but instead of hunt and destroy, we map the ruins for sale to the highest bidder and make a good living at it, too. There were five of us in the company until we lost Theo. Bullets. I'd say it was a whole lot of luck. We set as many traps as we could behind us and killed as many super mutants as possible. Being able to fend off the last wave of them made the rest more cautious, but it also drained our ammo. It's only a matter of time before they rally, especially since you punch through their lines. Stay frosty. Good to see you.
Good to see you in one piece. Then don't stand in front of me, eh? Thank you. Again, I'm not sure how to thank you. I'm going to head back to Ranger Compound to see if Riley's back yet. Look me up anytime you're in the neighborhood. If I can ever be of medical assistance or you need some supplies or repairs, let me or Donovan know. On the plus side, I've already been to the Ranger compound, so we can fast travel there. Good to be in one piece. Please give me a status report. You look like you've been through hell. Uh-huh. You're a cocky little thing, aren't you? I like that. <laughs> well, as much as I want to hear all about it, can you tell me a full debrief on what happened out there with my men? I'm very impressed at your skill. I don't think I've come across someone quite like you in the ruins. I suppose I owe you a debt. And I intend to pay it in kind. I'm sure you're more interested in your reward than listening to me talk. So let me get right to it. Losing a bit of the Merc Edge, eh? Hmm. Don't get soft on me now. Well, I've said it once, but I'll say it again. You have my thanks. I'd be pretty lost without my guys. So, for your reward, what'll it be? The Ranger battle armor, or one of Brick's miniguns? Sorry, we need every piece of equipment we've got. I can spare the gun and the armor, but that's about it. The armor it is. Wear it with pride, kid. We do. Consider this place your home away from home. If you're ever in the neighborhood again, you're more than welcome to take shelter here. I guess that does it. See you around, kid. Door is always open for you. Come back anytime. That was fun. I like that. It's a big ass dungeon too, man. Yeah, we're close to leveling up again. Not quite, but we're close. Something need fixing? Uh-huh. No problem. Let me have a look. Well, you're not going to do it for free? I am very disappointed.
I'll be honest, the minigun isn't worth repairing because I'll never use it. I'm just going to sell it anyway, probably. See you again. Let's see if they have a... Me and Eugene missed you. Well, all right, you're back. Me and old Eugene have been a bit sad lately. <laughs> no super mutants to mow down. I guess as soon as Riley's ready, we can head back out into the ruins. I wish I knew what she was waiting for. Out of curiosity. 24 damage reduction. So it's actually slightly better than the power armor right now. But the power armor isn't repaired all the way. Of course, neither is the battle armor. Oh, look at that. Plus one luck and everything there, too. Why did you have fast travel while you're loaded down too much? We're gonna try it, you know. So I'm gonna go sell some of this shit. Thinking probably Megaton? Yeah. You cannot fast travel over encumbered. Ah, eh, figures. Okay, what do we want to drop? We need to drop seven pounds. Let's go see if we can get our uh, power armor repaired up a little bit better. Sell some of this crap. Yeah, you need something? Here. You've done so much for us. I want you to have this. Thank you. It's all I have to offer you. No. place that would be here. Hope we get the rake the Brahmin. So are they intelligent?
I would like to sell you a lot of things that I don't want. I have so many assault rifles right now. I'm going to keep the Ranger Battle Armor, I think. Good hunting! Remember. Well, they're so expensive. to his power feel his glow I disarm that it's not going to release anybody to anything now piss off dude jeez I wish you could play stuff be better. It's just so it goes wherever. That's not where I wanted to go. I wanted to like over like right here on the shelf. It's fine, whatever. just doesn't want to. He just wants to roll around on the floor. You know, I think I'm going to swap helmets. repair a helmet and then I think I'm going to go to the headquarters for the of us shall know 
peace shall know an end to pain and shall know still but I can't think of the name my brain just went fart it's really loud too it's loud and annoying biggest brain fart ever hey don't mind the smell I was just testing if you can uh -huh. Unless it should probably go do the Meyer Lurks soon. I don't know. I'm supposed to not murder them all. I do have a stealth boy. That might help. Yeah? What do you need? I should let you know, I'm not going to use any of our equipment to provide parts for you. Yeah. Okay, let's see here. Don't need this. Should read that. You know, I'm never going to use this. I'm going to keep it though, anyway. Sniper rifle uses 308. Now I have 22 left. So we'll buy that. Kind of cool. Plus five sneak. Eat. Okay. A pleasure doing business with you. 
Steel be with you. Mm hmm. Locked very hard. I would love to get in there and just start stealing stuff. So I see like a missile launcher up there. Okay, I've been going for almost three hours. I need to get up and stretch my legs and use the bathroom. So. There's a bed around here I can sleep in. I should have done that. Should have done that back at my house. I need to talk to a doctor. <laughs> I need a doctor. You ever seen a super mutant head Oh yeah. God, it's beautiful. Hey, hey buddy. Hi. Yeah, so listen, thanks and all. Really great job you did there. Yep. I don't like you. I need to collect my wits and figure out what to do next. Listen, thanks for getting us through that. I'm not stupid. I know we wouldn't have made it without you. I'm sorry about your dad, and I'm sorry I've acted like an ass. Great. If there's anything I can do for you, let me know. Take a walk off. Take a long walk off, off a short pier. Bye. Yeah. No. Not an option. Okay. Welcome. What I wouldn't do to get my hands on one of those enclave vertebrates. Oh, it's probably on the other side, I bet. The Brotherhood is at your service. Yes? More than anyone else, I dare say. Certainly enough to know they're the greatest threat the Capital Wasteland has ever faced. The Brotherhood of Steel has encountered the Enclave mm -hmm. before, you see. Over 30 years ago, back in California. Then they were led by a President Richardson. Now we've got this Eden to contend with. It matters not now, as before they seek to control and destroy. All in the guise of restoring order. Your father, I fear, was just the beginning. Oh. The Brotherhood is an old organization going back to the years just after the war. We are but a part of it. What would you like to know? The Brotherhood began on the West Coast. It exists there still. We were dispatched to this location many years ago. In truth, the Brotherhood of Steel has been struggling for years, both here and back home. Honor, truth, courage. These virtues seem to have little meaning in these troubled times, I'm afraid. Ah, no. That's the real question, isn't it? Uh-huh. Our orders were, and are, to acquire any and all advanced technology. And we have, to the best of our abilities. But when I realized the extent of the super mutant threat, I felt it was my responsibility to aid the people in their struggle against them. Unfortunately, my superiors back west disagree with my assessment of the situation. They feel I've grown too attached to the local populace mm. and they're right 
In any event, the Enclave's arrival changes everything. It's been over 20 years since we arrived, and we've been struggling to contain Why are there super and eradicate mutants on the, East Coast? the super mutants for nearly as long. With the arrival of the Enclave, I have a terrible feeling the super mutants are the least of our worries. Brotherhood is at your service. How may I serve you, friend of steel? Sir? Is there a doctor in the house? Hey. What's up? says bring. Is that supposed to be brig? Oh, B-ring. Gotcha. I think I've ever been to B-ring. wasn't red so it's not stealing okay now about that getting up thing um uh... I'm going to go stretch my legs, get a, re get a refill on my drink, use the bathroom, and I will be back in just a couple minutes, and we will keep going for a bit longer. Wow. Three hours already. Be right back. Hour or two, probably. Maybe a little less, maybe a little more. We'll see, what, we'll see how the flow feels. Be right back.
Okay. Ugh. Hello, X Eastman X. How are you doing? I keep hitting escape instead of tab to close menus in this game. It's gonna drive me crazy at some point. Damn straight I do. I don't know that. Uh huh. <laughs> Fair enough. I I have the same problem. I do not actually. I'm actually doing pretty okay. But thank you. Um, I'm just trying to decide what quest to do next. I just got done doing the Riley's Rangers and the Vault 101 return quest. I'm just trying to decide what to do next, and I don't know yet. I may go ahead and continue the main storyline some more. I'm not sure yet. Please state the nature of the medical emergency. But thank you for asking. Medical procedures initiated. Administering treat. Error, error. There has been an error in the medical subsystem. Please run a level two diagnostic. Command accepted. Beginning level two systems diagnostic. Please stand by. <laughs> Elevator music. <laughs> diagnostic complete. Results indicate a level seven degradation in neural pathway. Zero. X-63A-82. No further information available. Neural pathway 0X-63A-82 governs the motor control interface bridging the main medical software and the unit's manipulator arms. The current damage level would cause erratic behavior, potentially forcing the unit to behave outside of design parameters. Thank you for the follow, Eastman, with the X's. Neural pathway 0X63A82 rerouted through neural pathway 0X374E82. Stand by. Full motor functions restored. Diagnostic reveals no critical failures. Asshole. Hey, 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 hey. Medical procedures initiated. Administering treatment. Why did you call Please me an asshole? Medical procedure complete. Further instructions. Acknowledged. Hitting the rack. <laughs> I'm actually not sure. I don't think I do. I should actually get it, I think. I bought this a really, really long time ago and just never really got around to playing it. Hail. Hail. This is fancy. Remaining fancy. Oh, hey, can I, can I sleep in this bed? Oh, I can't sleep in this bed. That makes me sad. Ah, I'm not surprised. Hail to you, stranger. I am Squire Maxon, royal servant of steel. It is an honor to make your acquaintance. He seems very uncertain. Oh, well, thank you. Your words are very kind. Kinder than those I usually hear. Is there something I can help you with? Oh, well, you see, I am descended from the great Roger Maxon, founder mm. of our order. 
I am the last of his line. Mm. They say my soul was forged from eternal steel, but I don't believe that. <laughs> I'm really just a normal boy. Yeah, I, I was sent to the Citadel many years ago to be fostered by elder lions. But that was before the Western elders lost um, faith in the elder. I really don't know if I'll ever get home, but, well, I kind of like it here. Sentinel Lions has been very kind to me. She's taught me so Morning, much. Sweet. You're asking me what I think about the Enclave? Well, the Brotherhood of Steel has actually faced the Enclave before. Back west. More than 30 years ago, according to our chronicles. Judging from those records, I say their soldiers are outfitted in advanced power armor Mark II. It's pretty strong. Better than our power armor. And some of their technology is amazing. Vertibirds. Plasma weapons that can turn a man to goo. Does that help? A little bit. No. But I could. I know I'm ready. I mean, no. it would be scary, but it's not fair that I have to sit inside while the knights go on patrol. I did go out one time, you know. Sarah, a, a Sentinel Lions, took me out. Just to show me. I killed a super mutant, too. I swear. I, uh, I also sort of shot Sarah, but... Just a little. It was just a flesh wound. <laughs> oh, yes. I've studied them quite a bit since I've been here. They're not all the same, you know. Besides the regular ones. There are also brutes. And after them, the masters. Combat shotguns. They're really tough. Yeah, combat shotguns. But the worst of all? The behemoth. He's a giant. I saw one once. Outside the Citadel walls. So scary. The super mutants are all over the city ruins. But Elder Lions doesn't actually think they're from there. Or we would have found their home by now. It kind of seems like they're looking for something. But we're not really sure what that is. The business into my gun? Very well. I think that, I think that must be what they're looking for. This is the only thing that makes sense. They fight it very often. Welcome. What aid can I offer you, outsider? What's the latest report? Okay, let me see if I can figure out how to get back out of here. Need something, friend? The cool. Brotherhood is at your service. Just walk around in circles a little bit. Be cool. Be cool. Hey. I'm not convinced this armor is actually powered. I think it's just heavy. Let us, you know, I think we're going to do this next. Maybe this. What do you get for doing the whole survival guide? I think I'm missing a lot of stuff on the map too. I mean, seriously, there's like nothing down here. I have to have missed some stuff. This is almost all my quests that have kept me busy in this little cluster right here. Why do I know where Vault 108 is and haven't been there yet? What was I looking for? I don't remember. Oh. I 
gotta check something. Um, I don't remember. Never went there. It's fine. Don't care. I walked there from Megaton. It wasn't that far. It wasn't near as far as it looks like it does. That's very distant. It's fine. We'll go do that. We'll go do that. I could go wrong, other than I'll get shot at immediately. Hello. Oh, I would love to hear something annoying about Fallout 76. Okay, what was I doing? That's right, I was going this way before I started getting shot at by freaking lasers. Um, be friend or foe. Caps the fast travel? That doesn't make any sense. I'm gonna go with foe. That feels like, that certainly feels like foe. Ow, fuck. Who the hell is nuking me? Let's avoid the camp full of guys with nukes. I don't know what that is, but looks angry and hungry. And faster than I am really comfortable with at all. Um, that physics though, right? 
Combat shotgun, man. Combat shotgun. That's what's for breakfast. You know, I need to drop that so I don't eat it on accident. The sky color just changed when I walked up here. Are you on a mobile device or a desktop browser? Laptops count as desktop, by the way. It's weird, I agree. <laughs> Friendly neighborhood lard pupper. Should be okay. I don't know Morse code. Does anybody know Morse code? <laughs> That's nice. And now I will open the gate. Man. I don't know that I like being on this side of the map. This has just been one giant shit fest after another. shooting at do I want to help them I meant the person who's shooting at not the not help the super mutants oh, they're shooting Brahmin
They're shooting a lot of Brahmin. What the hell? I made friends. Okay. I was using his head. Right there, you think? That that outhouse? I don't do real saves very often. Seems like a good time to though. Maybe. Uh, no. No, it's not. Little lamplight. Seems like a nice place to just leave ammo laying around for me to take. I like them already. You know, clipping through the fence is cheating. Aha, there we go. Let's go up first. This place looks homey. Peaceful. Somewhat destroyed. Hey, look, a bus stop.
Hi. My god, it's everywhere. I don't like this. 8 p.m. to 2 a.m. for you. 2 p.m. to 8. That's 5 till. That would overlap with my normal stream time. So I'm not sure if I'll do it or not. I need to think about that. Right? Five to eleven, is that right? I think that's right. I'm going to eat some raw mashed potatoes because they taste good. Some raw instant mashed potatoes because they taste good. Plus 10% damage. That's nice. Am I going backwards? I am going backwards, aren't I? You're right. So it is 11 through 5. I might be able to do a little bit of it. Why don't I have a weapon equipped that I can use? Yep. Don't take another step or we'll blow your fucking head off. You're big, and I don't have any big friends. You better just go out the way you came in. You don't want to go there. That's where the monsters are. We got pretty good at keeping them out. Probably better than you could do. The big ones. You know, the ones that sort of look like people, except they're all wrong. Yeah, I do, but it's through Little Lamplight, and you're not getting into Little Lamplight. Guess you better find some other way, Mungo. Hell no! No Mungo's allowed! Why should I trust you? I got no reason to. You Mungos are nothing but trouble. I ain't gonna let what happened to Sammy and Squirrel happen to anyone else. Them and Penny got themselves caught by Mungos, oh. just like you. Slavers from Paradise Falls. I told them to watch out, but the stupid kids didn't listen. You do that? Maybe. If you can bring them back, I might let you in. I already told you. must think I'm stupid or something. Okay. This is Little Lamplight. We live here, and we don't need no mungos messing it up. So just take a hike. Why would I tell you anything? God, you're dumb. I'm McCready. I run Little Lamplight because they made me the mayor, and I don't like strangers or mungos.
I don't know. This clip looks pretty okay. <laughs> I probably would have clipped it a little bit shorter, but it's not a bad clip. Thirty-one percent speech chance. Where did I save last? Um. Oh, hey, right here. Yeah. So let's let's reload this. Walk down here. Let's take the hat off because it's minus one charisma. Oh, no, it's not because I'm not wearing the. Um... Okay, that's fine then. Save here. Hold it right there, lady. Don't. think I'm stupid or something. I'm Only a little bit. This feels cheating. Is this cheat? Does anybody think this is cheating? I only take four or five tries, worst case. Hold it right there, lady. Don't. We you can't quick save during your conversation. Oh, I'm sad. I'm stupid or something. Is it auto? It says 31%, but it feels like auto fail, but maybe it doesn't. I mean, I don't mind going back to rescue the kids. So we'll, do, we'll try this a few more times. Hold it right there, lady. Don't. You're. Help. You must think I'm. St you. There, lady. Don't. You're... Well, okay, but you better not be lying, or else we'll shoot you. Not, not auto fail. Happy birthday, Sticky. Sorry, I missed your party. Okay, so you get in, but I got my eye on you. You don't make any trouble in here. Got it? I ain't having no shit butts making trouble. I'm not a shit butt. If you've got the adult sized stones to stop me. <laughs> oh. Good. You don't want to go there. We got pretty good. The yeah, I do. It's through Murder Pass. Not a real safe way to go, but it's the Murder only Pass sounds like a wonderful place. It's the only way that works, yeah. The other door hasn't worked since before I was here. Computers busted and not even Joseph can make it work. I'm the mayor, not a babysitter, Mungo. Beats me. Maybe he's back there by the door. Exhibition point Discord know. to give you a link. And there's one down in the panels. Under social. Organized? Have you walked around this place? It's pure anarchy. I wouldn't have it any other fucking way. <laughs> we can't all stay here forever, so we've all got to leave eventually. And there's not much to look forward to out there. So we have a good time while we're here. And the occasional ruthless little bastard like me makes sure it doesn't fall apart for the other kids. People change when they grow up, and we don't trust Mungo's living down here. So we leave for a place called Big Town before we get too old. Kids who grow up fighting and surviving in Lamplight are better trained for the world out there than idiots who are pampered by grown-ups outside. It's not that complex. Any kid can say they want to be mayor here. It's just that most don't want to bother with the responsibility of leading. Most of the time, they last until the kids get tired of them. Then they get kicked out on their ass. <laughs> One only lasted mayor. five minutes. One only lasted five minutes. Of course, I've kept this place going strong for three years. To most kids, 
That makes me mayor for fucking life. Fine by me, I say. What do I look? I'm McCready. I. You sure about that? It's scary in there. Even I don't like going in there, and I'm really brave. Okay, don't worry. That's... Yeah, me too. Sorry. There's nothing happy about it. This is the worst day of my life. It's time to go. You know the rules. Wow, what luck! I'm sticky. Forget these little kids. I'll take you to Big Town where the Mungos, I mean, where the grown-ups live. I'm headed there now. Nah, I'm a grown-up now. I can handle myself. There's no reason to waste your time with the kiddies at Little Lamplight. They'll steal your caps when you aren't looking. So let's go to Big Town. I can show you the way. I'm not allowed in Little Only people under 18 get to live in Little Lamplight. So when you're done with those little kids, we can go to Big Town together. I'll wait outside for you. I'm kind of terrified about what Big Town's going to be like. Hey. Gosh, you're big. Yeah, it looks okay right now. Of course, I wasn't watching a second ago. Excuse me. Murder Pass sounds like a fun vacation spot, though. <laughs> Alright, what time is it? Uh, 7.25 p.m. What time it all closes? <laughs> yeah, I can't do anything about it doing that. That's all stream Streamlabs doing the chat stuff for me. Get it right, Streamlabs. Part of my sniffles. Sorry about that. <laughs> Wait, is this still locked? Well, they did say it was an anarchy, but I still feel kind of bad picking the lock. I feel like I'll get in trouble for that in a way I don't like. Um, I should go check out Big Town. Then we come back here. I bet you there's nothing in here anyway. I don't know why I assumed they'd be running a shop. That was probably silly of me. Didn't hear a scuffle, so I'm guessing you're some sort of guest. So, what's so cool about you, Fancy Pants? Must be a pretty good reason for you to get let in, see? Always good to hear, but not even any fun trouble? Even a little? See, I collect a lot of stories, and sometimes trade them to keep the others amused. A bit of fun trouble is always good for morale. More owls better than less owls, see? It's true. Well, when people started calling Nikki by his new name, I needed one too, see? If you're twins, it just doesn't cut it to be called Nick Knack and Sue. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, technically, I'm patrolling and keeping the peace. 
Mostly, that involves making sure people are happy and not getting into trouble. You can't very well keep the peace if you've already lost it. See? She's pretty smart. So, bam. Jokes. Want to hear one? Hit me. Prepare to be amused. Knock, knock. Noah. Hey, that's good. I was just going to say, Noah, a place where I can get some food. <laughs> Speech. 100%. That was, um, really funny. Lie. <laughs> Gee, thanks. I have to admit, most of them aren't really funny. <laughs> At least not ha-ha funny. <laughs> They're more like a tradition. Most of them were passed down from this book we found down back, called Vault Boy's Big Book of Laughs for Kids. They're not really funny, but something about hearing them is a little comforting, you know? Yes. Oh, we've got lots of funny incidents. Like when Sammy shot the raider who thought he was a girl, that sort of stuff. But we don't really get a lot of news stories from outside. The scav teams spend all their time hidden, so they don't get much news, see? I'd sure like to hear more tales from the great big outdoors myself. Actually, if you hear any, feel free to tell me. Oh, really? Tell me about it. Long ago, my people were buried away. Now I have risen to terrorize the wastes. Wow, that sounds like it took some guts. Life down here might get dull, but I gotta admit, at least I don't get shot at. Well, Which question not as was much it? anyway. Tell me more. What's happened since then? They work for you? Wow. They must think About you're the Thursday? most important Mungo in the world. Maybe. Wastes. I'm not sure. So what happens next? Oh. No, I have not found that place yet. And I don't see that message at all. So I think it just didn't get sent. So, yeah, weird. That makes sense, I suppose. A good story can take a while to put together, you know. But I have somebody that wants to lead me to there, so. And we're going to go there soon. Oh, wait, is this open now? Can I go in here without, like, breaking and entering? Nope. Is that yours? Whoa, are we letting Mungo's in now? Didn't hear any shots, so I'm guessing you're not here to raid us. And if you're not here to raid us, you might just have brought something cool for us, see? So, who are you? And how'd you get let in? I imagine that the parents die in the waste, probably. And the other kids find them and take them in. In that case, I'm Nick Knack, and I take care of the general store around here. Which is to say, I collect a lot of stuff, and sometimes trade it for other stuff. That's pretty much a store, see? Oh, boy. He has... Actually, a reasonably decent repair skill. I mean, 15 is okay for an NPC. You should get dressed. Waiter. Or you could just stay home today. I'm a terrible person. Why is there a door to the restrooms? Nah, let's not do that. Essentials. Essen vitals? Es vitals? Oh, essentials. Gotcha. 
reading is my forte. Okay, let's go to Big Town. Can I pet you? That's two dogs I've seen so far. This place is a maze. Wow. Hey. I was pondering maybe streaming tomorrow during the day, but maybe I won't. We'll see. Have a good one. Take it easy. Mungo land. Down. You want to go to Big Town? Of course you do. It's east of Little Lamplight. Come on, let's go there. It's not that far away. We'll be there in no time. Oh, I forgot I had that on. It was for my birthday. Here, you take it. I don't want it anymore. All right. Oh, you're following me there? Like, I know where to go. Why is this taking so long? Because you're following me for a reason I don't fully understand. I like the way that the game takes your gun away for, you? from you for when you first run into the little lamplight so you don't immediately shoot the kids. It's actually, I'm sure they play tested that a lot, to be honest. Are you lost? Are you sure you know where you're going? I mean... It's east of Little Lamplight. Come on, let's go there. It's not that far away. We'll be there in no time. Come on. We're going to get killed, aren't we, on the way there? Oh, there it is. I know. Let's make up a story to pass the time. Once upon a time, there was this dog. His name was Holy Toledo, and he was really powerful. Why is there a vertebrate park there? Oh, God. Okay. Um, you should stay here. Or you're going to get killed on the way. You know what? Maybe that's okay. Wah, wah, wah. And all his friends laughed at him. The end. Thank you. Thank you very much. Huh. They're not wearing, all wearing power armor. Did they do get mad if I shoot them? Are we there yet? Why is this taking so long? Teach you to mess with me. Right. Be sneaky. I can do that. Help me. Look out. Uh, oh, wow. Mm, plasma guns are the best. That hurt like a son bitch. I think that I think I made a bad decision there. That would be the definition of a bad decision, by the way. Right, right there. That, that. 
they, they threw a grenade and blew my legs off. Very rude. I know. Or, Let's make up a story to pass the time. I think they're still there? Once upon a time, there was this man. His name was... Huh. Could go around. I seem to have misplaced my child. I'm sure he'll be fine. Two XP. Yeah, it was worth it. Cliffhanger question: Vertebrae take off, but I don't think I don't think they put those animations in the game. Traffic's okay. You win some, you lose some. Must be a level thing. Because this area did not used to be this dangerous. I guess I'm thinking that, that cluster of houses might be it.
Ah, okay, there's the wall. Comes where the hell is the front door at? Who are you? Right. What do you want? I was thinking you gotta start a few fires and kill some people. <laughs> well, you can never be too careful. Be warned, it's not safe here. Super mutants have attacked recently and carried off some of our friends. Come in, just don't cause any trouble, okay? I can feel it. Uh, what, you? I gave you the welcoming speech. There was a super mutant attack recently, and where there's one big ugly, there are ten more just waiting to grab you by the throat. Then the slavers will come and pick off what's left of your carcass and drag any survivors to Paradise Falls. It's twice I've heard Paradise Falls. Nearby? Slavers move quick and come from all directions. Someone else might know where they nest. There isn't anything here that hasn't been destroyed or dragged away. You're better off scavenging the dead out in the wasteland. Sometimes you'll see small, tired dots on the horizon instead of angry, anxious ones. Those are settlers who come here from lamplight. The poor fools. There's nothing here but the stench of death and the threat of attack looming over every sunset. Man. Two very angry types of movements. Slow, lumbering, powerful movements and jerky, erratic, excitable movements. Both coming for the kill. Bye. Hey, don't get any bright ideas about trying anything. We may not look it, but every one of us is a trained killer. Oh, who am I kidding? Look, we're in trouble here. If you want to help, great. If not, just please don't kill anyone while you're here. <sighs> Well, we've got super mutants out that way and slavers up that way. Take your pick. They both come in here, drag off as many as they can carry, and shoot whoever puts up a fight. The best we can ever hope for is that they get here at the same time and fight over who gets to kill us. And where are we going to go? Megaton won't have us, Lamplight won't take us back, and Rivet City is too far. 
Besides, the bunch of us can't even hold this town. Can you imagine us schlepping across the wasteland? There aren't many of us left. There's me and Pappy. Red runs the clinic, but she's been taken by the mutant. Kimba does what she can. And there's Bittercup. She's just about as useless as a human being can be. Time Bomb was hurt in the last raid, so he's out. That's about it. The mutants and slavers have taken everyone else. Just us and a couple of guns are all that's left. Yeah. We all used to live in a place called Little Lamplight, but they have a rule about age. You reach 16, and you're out. Didn't matter, though, because you just pack your things and head to Big Town. All the adults go there, and there's plenty to eat. Plenty to eat, all right, if you like eating bullets. I've lost count of how many times I've been shot at. Look, the only place to go is the town hall, and that's just a meeting spot for us. There aren't any traders or anything around here. What? You've never seen a super mutant before? Oh, no, I've seen them. They're mean and I mean, ugly these particular and super hell. mutants. They came and rounded up a bunch of us and carried them off. God, they must be doing awful things to them. I'd go rescue them, but then who'd defend Big Town? I patrol every day now. And I got a little present for those muties when they come back. You know what it is? This kick-ass gun. That's what. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Yeah. They went northeast. Probably to the Germantown police headquarters. They have guns. And they're mean. So you better be careful. You gonna rescue them or what? That's totally awesome. Yeah. Okay. While you're out on your mission. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Cool. Hey, did I show you my new gun? It's totally awesome. God, they never, they really never did grow up, did they? Keep an eye out. For Do we know anything about the slavers? my medicine skill out of curiosity. No, we're close. Drink out of this toilet for four hit points and a ton of radiation. So everybody knows toilet water has more radiation in it. I hate it here. A visitor? Who'd want to visit this hellhole? I'll bet you're here to rape and pillage us, aren't you? Aren't you? Not that it matters. We're all super mutant snacks anyway. Well, if you feel like dying, go right on ahead. They're up there at some police station near Germantown. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Yeah, you're telling me. 
Everything that could go wrong goes wrong. The super mutants and slavers seem to take turns beating the crap out of us. There's no way for us to fight back, so we just keep building barricades around town. Now nah, we've been pushed back all the way. Nowhere left to run now. Most of us came from Little Lamplight. We got too old, so they kicked us out. Brats. Always heard stories about how great Big Town was, where the grown-ups go. But there's nothing here except death and sand. We're all gonna die. Woohoo! <laughs> Entropy wins in the end. Yay! Oh, come on. Pay more attention to what you're doing. Welcome to Big Town. Not that there's much of a town left. Those super mutants keep kidnapping people. Oh, Little Lamplight is where most of us came from. Red and Pappy and Flash and Bittercup. We used to play together when we were kids. Then we got old and we had to leave. Those were the rules. So we packed up and headed here, like we were supposed to. No one told us it would be like this. We never have fun anymore. And most of us, most of us are dead. Oh, there's somewhere to the northeast. Whenever those things come, they grab a few people instead of killing them. No one knows what happens after that. No one wants to know. There's. There's FUB. always so much blood after they come, and then someone has to move the bodies. I'm so tired of being... Remember to keep an eye on the north. Oh, it's after my mind fill. I think that I'm going to stop here for tonight. And then starting next time, we'll help out Big Town. We'll see if we get it straightened out. And we'll see where it goes from there. I kind of want to go check on the slavers too now. So maybe we won't main quest line quite yet. Maybe. But thank you for hanging out with me. I've had fun. I hope you guys had fun watching. I feel like I keep making more progress, which makes me happy. Uh, let's check and see here. How oh, does that auto host auto host a peep or two? So thank you for hanging out with me. I'm going to go hit the sack um, tomorrow night. Be here for some more Octopath Traveler, the game that never ends. But for now, I bid you a fun, good remainder of your morning, day, evening or night. And I'm going to make sure I save this. Did I save this? Yes, I saved this. And I will see you next time, I hope. But for now, ciao.